Hi and welcome to the start of this video tutorials. Cardpresso is a very simple but powerful and user-friendly software with which you can create your own plastic card. You can personalize the card with any background you want and fill it with text, barcodes, lines, shapes, images, photos and signatures in front and back side. This tutorial will teach you how to create an ID card, apply a background, create a text box and manipulate the text inside it. Let's start by clicking the Create button on the screen. Now, choose the card type that you will use. Let's choose CR80, which is the most common type. Now, we can start our business card creation. In this case, my business card. Choose a background to your card. I'm choosing the card press background that I have it in my computer. We choose the image and then click open, then accept it. Now I have it as a picture, but I'm going to define it as a background. Click with the right mouse button on the picture and then choose background option. Okay, next step will be inserting on our card the logo of your company, in this case, CardPress logo. And the process is basically the same. And here it is. All you have to do now is to define its location and size on the card. Like this. On the design toolbar, click on the text button to start to fill the card with all the data that is commonly used on a business card. Let's start by my name. Double click inside the text box, a window pop up. Here, you can start writing your name as a normal text editor. Now, we go to the Position tab to know the exact location and size of our text box. Then, we drag the text box to its final position and adjust the boundaries to avoid letter cuts. After that, we go to the Font tab and change font size if needed. And to point my name on the card, we use the bold effect. Now we do for the other fields as we did for name field. We go to the design toolbar and click the text button. The process is exactly the same, as you can see. OK. After that, we go to the font tab and change font size if needed. Now we go to the position tab to know the exact location and size of our text box. Then we drag the text box to its final position and adjust the boundaries to avoid letter cuts. And now we go to the design toolbar and click the text button. And now my mobile and email address. And because they have the same font size and type, we can put them on the same box. The process is exactly the same. Like this. And now we drag the text box to its final position and adjust boundaries to avoid letter cuts. We go to the design toolbar and click the text button. Finally, the company site address. That will be www.cartpresso.com. OK. Now, drag the text box to its final position. Adjust the boundaries to avoid letter cuts, like this. After that, we go to the Font tab to see if need to change the font size. And to point the site address on the card, we'll use again the bold effect like we did with my name. OK, this is all the information that we have on our business card. And of course, it's just one example. With one detail, we made the set tab of the card at the same time, is one method. I'm sure you'll get your own. All you have to do now is save your work by pressing Ctrl S or Command S on Mac. 
like this. As you can see, your business card is ready. Simple, isn't it? Now, click the print button to print it. How? Well, that's a subject for another tutorial. Thank you for choose Cardpresso and goodbye.